In this video, I'm gonna show you how to remove dead bugs from bumper fast, easy, and more importantly, safe, only using four items, so stay tuned. Welcome back to the Simple Driver channel. My name is Calvin. Recently, I took a trip to Jacksonville, Florida to go see some in-laws, and on my way back to Atlanta, it's about a five-hour trip, it was nighttime, I must have killed about a thousand bugs. As you can see, my bumper is trashed out here. I have blood, guts, legs, wings, shells, all kind of stuff. And uh, I gotta get this off of here. As you know here, I got, you know, you can see I killed some flies, I killed some, you know, cicadas, some love bugs. And to top it off, I got hit with freaking bird poop, which is really bad because bird poop has uric acid in it and that doesn't even dissolve well in water. So. I have to get this off and it's gotta be a safe way to do it because at this point, it's been overnight, these uh, bugs are dried on here and they're acting like little pebbles and rocks uh, on my vehicle. So if I take this rag here and I slap it on here and I start scrubbing vigorously to get it off, what's gonna happen is I'm going to put abrasions and scratches inside of my paint and I don't want to do that. So the best way to take this these dead bugs off your front bumper of your car is to use a couple products. Here I have bug and tar remover. Uh, this is Turtle Wax uh, brand. You can use whatever you want. Some people use Citrol because it's a foam, right? Some people use, you know, a product made by Rain X. You got mothers out there, but any bug and tar remover is going to work because they're all designed to not, you know, to, to, to be friendly for your paint and your clear coat. So that's the bug and tar remover. The next thing I have here is uh, Meguiar's Gold Glass. This is just a car wash shampoo because you don't want to put dishwashing detergent on your vehicle. I mean, there's times that you need to do that, but in this case, I do not. I just want to wash my vehicle with some uh, good shampoo. I have my bucket and I have here a microfiber towel with a grit guard inside of my bucket, which means once I start putting uh, this, uh, wiping this these bugs off and I put it back inside of here, I'm gonna use that grit guard to get rid of those bugs so I don't put them back on the paint. So, let's go ahead and get started with the process. The first thing you wanna do is turn the nozzle on, obviously. And I'm gonna just show you here, and I actually like this because it, it's not dripping, it's actually kinda of foamy, so that's pretty good. So I'm gonna spray this on here, and uh, let's just, oh, I got a bee here, you see that? Okay, this is what happens when you shoot outside. But I'm gonna go ahead and uh, show you how this works. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna take my microfiber towel here and I'm just going to gently start. Look at that. And it hasn't even been that long and these bugs are starting to come off pretty good. You don't have to put a lot of pressure. Look, look at this, look at that. You see that? Look at that. Come check this wash bucket. Look down in here. You can see that there's uh, blood, look at that, blood guts and stuff like that. And that's because I have a, you know, a grit guard inside of my bucket. This is not a professional detailed job. I'm doing this in a way that you will understand that this is how it would be when you're at home. If you're not a professional detailer, you just want to get the bugs off of your vehicle without scratching your paint. So, all right, so that took about all of five or six minutes really to get this going. Grab my pressure washer just so I can take off the bugs out of the radiator and stuff like that. You may not have a pressure washer at home, but if you do, make sure that it's the 25 degree uh, nozzle because if you put a 15 or a zero or something like that, you're gonna start taking paint off your car. All right, so I just finished pressure washing it. You can come in and take a, take a closer look here. I wanna show you uh, the bugs are gone. You can see I have some nicks in my paint, which I'm gonna have to take care of probably a video to show you how to do that, clay bar it down or whatnot. But as far as dead bugs on my bumper and me removing them and without scratching my paint, that is done. So with that being said, grab your bucket with a grip guard, put some elbow grease in this thing and go to work. And here is your end result. Boom.